Hello everyone, it's Wednesday, wonderful Wednesday, the 13th of September today. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels. And I'm going to bring in the beautiful Healing Blessings Nature Oracle today. I love this deck. So what do we need to know? Wow. Well, such a great message for Twin Flames there. We've got the stag again. So this card came out in Tuesday's reading. Very powerful. The stag saying the masculines are promising you union and there's a big transition taking place. Now, what I'm actually connecting with for everyone, because not everyone watching this is a twin flame, even though most of you are and will resonate with the journey in some way, shape or form. But it's letting you know that in your life, you've been going through a big transformation, a transformation that may have been happening since 2020 or even before that, to become your best self, your greatest version, to do things your way. And the signs right now are showing you that you are a manifester, that you are creating your dreams, that magic is coming in. So what's your heart's greatest desire right now? You have the chance right now for your biggest dreams to become reality. And this is so powerful because we've got the new moon tomorrow and you're going to be feeling this energy today and it's all about creation. You have the power to create your dreams. So the angels, the heavens, the universe, they're shining their blessings down upon you today. So make the wish a big one. So today, update your vision board. Put in your creation box what you want to create. Talk to the angels. Dream big, visualize it, feel it because luck is on your side. And you've got the kingfisher because... Be ready for anything. So this is a huge sign about dreams manifesting, opportunities coming into you, things happening. So if you're wanting a new job and you've polished your resume, be ready for anything. If you're updating your wardrobe and you want to go somewhere, be ready for anything. If you want to manifest better things in your life, be ready for anything. And if you want to meet up with your twin flame or you want to go out and meet new people or you want to do new things, be ready for anything and accept invitations as they come to you. If you get an unexpected invitation to go to a party or go to an event or do something new, this could be your chance. So go for it. Be ready for anything because luck is on your side and all the things you do are showing you how far you've come. So maybe you are planning on doing something that you've never done before. This could even be coming to my live event in London in May next year. I know so many of you are already coming to this, but so many of you want to. And you may be afraid because it's in London and you may be in another part of the world. But you may be even attending this is going to be a big learning curve and a big show of power to you because you're saying, yes, I can do this. I don't have to rely on anybody else to be with me or go with me or, you know, be around me because you do it yourself. So I feel the stag is a symbol of independence and it's a symbol of your independence is your power because you know you don't have to wait around for anyone else. You do it your way. And this is such a great message as well for Twin Flame Union because for the Divine Feminine, before union, live your best life. And you're going to live your best life in union anyway, but do what you want to do. Go where you want to go. Embrace your uniqueness, your bravery, your courage to be you and go where you want to go. So if you want to go to an event or you want to go to the cinema on your own or you want to go shopping or whatever you want to do, do it. You have the power. So a big transition is taking place in your life right now. As you prepare for the next steps, it may have happened gradually over the last five years, and that's what they're telling me, but you're learning to be gentle and kind to yourself during this process. And I feel even over the next five years, you're going to be moving everything into place. So you may be thinking about your five-year plan now. You may be thinking, what do I want to manifest? What, where do I want to be in five years? What do I want to be creating? What type of work do I want to do? What type of money do I want to be bringing in? What type of home do I want to live in? What's my relationship going to look like? These are things you can start planning and manifesting now because the best is yet to come and that's what you're being shown today. So signs and synchronicities coming to you to say, what's your greatest desire because you can manifest it? And then once you've set that intention, be ready for anything because the universe is going to show you you can achieve it. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.